Okay, we're back to Talking with Troy. I am your host, Troy Catheter. And you know, folks, sex addiction is rarely talked about. The sense of shame around (laughs) it has made the subject taboo, completely taboo. But now the makers of Celebrity Sex Rehab with Dr. Drew present Republican Sex Rehab with Dr. Drew. This really is a show that has been needed for a long time. Here, Dr. Drew discusses this particular group of GOP sex addicts. It's pretty representative, I'd say. We have people that were love addicted. We have people who are severe. Really sex addicted. We have people with chemical addictions. We have gay and straight. It runs the gamut there. All right, good stuff. Let's meet the patient, shall we? With a penchant for sex with those who work closest with him, Senator John Ensign faces up to the consequences of his disease. Last year, I had an affair. I violated <laughs> the vows of my marriage. Here's Governor Mark Sanford, hopelessly addicted to romantic fantasies, taking a hard look, <laughs> taking a look at his actions. I developed um, a relationship with a, uh, which started as a dear, dear friend from Argentina. Here's solo sex addict <laughs> Carrie Pre- uh, uh, Jean. What is it? Okay, Carrie Prejean confronting her demons as well. You know, I was by myself. I sent it to a boyfriend. It was for, you know, private use, but does that justify what I did? No, it was the biggest mistake of my life. And Now, in the show, the Republicans will live all together in this house on C Street in Washington, D.C. They'll receive daily counseling sessions from Dr. Drew's helper, ordained deacon and OBGYN Tom Coburn. But along the way, there will be relapses. <laughs> Oh. Oh, she's in here. Oh. Okay. Carrie? Oh. Oh. Carrie? Oh, I know something oh. terrible is happening. Oh. Carrie, what's going on? I think she's crashed. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Dramatic stuff. This is going to be something to watch. Republican sex rehab with Dr. Drew. Meet the people who put the heel in healing. Maybe David Vitter put it best. Because we all have a lot of important work to do. Okay. It's the Talking with Troy show. I'm your host, Troy Catheter. Up next, you know him as Levi Johnston. His new name is Ricky Hollywood, and he's bringing new meaning to the phrase Northern Exposure. We'll get back at you. Oh, I want to set my DVR for that. Is that on Bravo? Is it on Bravo or VH1? Bravo? C-SPAN. Okay, good. All right, then. Yes, all those clips came from C-SPAN, except for uh, uh, when Harry met Sally, except for that one. Uh, unbelievable what's going on. I, I mean, the hypocrisy of this party is is endless, absolutely, unbelievably endless. But you know why they get away with it? I finally realized it yesterday when Orrin Hatch actually said uh, of this health care bill that, uh, it, that this is going to be a holy war. Orrin Hatch says that this will be a holy war. Great! Conservatives have just declared jihad on health care.